Uh, hello everyone, my name is Lomfatsi. Today we're back again in May to actually Sam Stolly. And no, this is not my um, original man bot. This is the man bot that I bought second hand. So, let's go. I hope it won't have any problem. I cannot remember. <laughs> Ed, Sam again. I'm in position. Reading you loud and clear, Sam. I'm going full ahead. We'll be there in a couple of minutes. Meet me at the seafront. Roger that, Ed. Sam out. Thanks for arming the traps back there. As soon as you left, a whole horde of mutants decided to crash my party. I don't know if I'd be talking to you if not for the traps. <laughs> I'm glad I could help. Here's your suit, Ed. Thanks. I'd better put it on right now. Hold on to this. I'll be quick. How did it go? <laughs> Good. Ah, I still put it on in regulation time. So, are you ready to enter the lair of the beast? Always ready. How do we get there? We can take the boat right to the spot. The access tunnel is half floated. We'll have to open a few gates though. So we'll need to split up at the entrance. Here is the bunker plan. I marked everything I know on it. At the spot, we load the rods on the boat and make our best speed out. We'll take a shortcut, the sea tunnel. Got it. We expect any hostiles? Just the zap spiders. What was that? Huge freaking spiders. They accumulate electric charge and hit you with it. They can also switch off lamps, stop motors, but if you chase them away, everything comes back online. Killing them is hard, but incendiaries work wonders. Spasibo. Just what the world needs. More kinds of huge freaking spiders. You're welcome. Well, we're here, Sam. See that gate? First of all, we'll need to turn the backup power on using the panel in the guard room. That should be enough for the lights and the electric blocks. But we need generators to power the rest. Got it, Ed. So, I start the generators, we load the fuel and leave? Exactly. Well, make a landfall, and good luck. Good luck. Great job, Sam. Now, proceed to the generator room. We need the main power back on if we're going any further. Roger that. What the... So 
what it is. Yup. So Let's put one of those zap spiders I told you about. Always kill its kind first. Got it. Spasibo. Should have brought torches. Yes, we should have. Prigadica. I'm in the generator room. Great. Now find the master switch. Roger. Get over it. Anyway, how did these electric abominations come to be? I guess this place is just cursed. <laughs> With so much radiation and anomalies around, it's not surprising. Yeah, that's true. to the channel should be in the room next to yours. You go there while I climb up that crane. Thank you. 
Mutation into the next level. I hope in the next metro I will find these guys. Roger, Ed. I'm on it. Diploja. I'm all right, Ed. The lift is not, though. As long as you're okay, we're fine. Find the ventilation entrance and go up the vents to get here. Acknowledged.
I thought it'd be easier. Me too. Spiders are a bit too much, really. I hate those fuckers. I don't think even their mamas like them. Still, we pulled it off. We're almost out of the tunnel, too. So, congratulations, I guess. Thank you. Damn. This rubber is stuffy as hell. You're right about that. What now, Ed? I guess it's time to call Tom. Yes. Tom, Sam here. We have the fuel rods and are heading for the dock. Oh, great news. We'll prepare for the loading operation. What's your ETA? About an hour. About an hour. Good. We'll be waiting for you then. Tom out. We're all set. All right. It's full steam ahead. I don't think it'd be easy. For the record, I do understand why people would follow Tom. I really do. Of course, his talk of restoring the civilization is bullshit, but I can't even say I hate him, honestly. Klim with his atrocities, on the other hand. Still, Klim's not in charge. Tom is. And be he the savior and Buddha in one person, I still could never agree with him. Still manning the gate? Give me a break! Yes, sir! It's me! Well, open up, if that's the case! Yes, Captain, sir! Opening up! I'm really happy to see you back, Captain, sir! Me too. Me too. Sam, before we arrive, I'd like to ask you to hear me out. You're a good guy. Honest? Nice. You were nice the moment we met. I remember you put your gun down. So I'll be frank with you. I can't let Tom have the soap. I just can't. I already told you how much of a risk it is. So I won't repeat myself, you know it all. I should have taken her out to sea and scuttled her there long ago. But uh, I just couldn't. It would be like murdering my immortal soul. She bears no blame. She served us and kept us alive all these years. But now I have no choice. There is a charge in one of the roads. The guys put it in there in case we got caught. This is the detonator. I will be searched, but you... You are Tom's best pal, his negotiator. So, just press the button when I give you the signal. Don't worry, it won't go nuclear. But no bastard will ever be able to use my ship for anything after that thing goes off. I understand that you'll be losing your ticket home that way. But I think I know you well enough, son. And it seems that you're not ready to pay Tom's price. Still, if I am wrong, just toss the thing and be done with it. All I'm asking is, give it a thought, okay? I have nobody else to rely on, Sam. Thank you for your trust, Ed. I won't let you down.
Well, Sam, I hope you make the right decision. I don't know if it's gonna be worth it or not. I just want to go home. America. And this is probably my only ticket. I don't know. I don't know. Not so fast. First, your iron. And the pockets out, too. What the hell's going on here? Stop it! Mmm, I see you have new people. Yes, sir. Sorry about that, comrade captain. I'm so glad so to see you. So am I, son. I'm very sorry. But you can't keep the weapons. I'll have to search you, too. It's all right. I understand. How are you? Get married yet? <laughs> Not yet, comrade captain. No time for that. Too busy here. You're doing well, Vitya. I always knew you'd go far. We gotta search this one too. No need. Sam is with us. Glad you're here, Sam. Well, hello there, Cap. How long has it been? Huh? Hello there yourself, Tom. Not long enough, I think. <laughs> really? Well, then again, maybe you're right. Another year out there, fresh air and all that, could have convinced you to agree to command this sub under my flag. Ha! <laughs> fresh air? It always felt stuffy out there, you know. Well, could it be a heart problem? With your age, you know. Ah, uh, no. It's just that you were around all the time. <laughs> I'll feel better too, sailing the high seas away from you. What's that noise out there? Say to us forgetting our differences until we solve this problem. A truce? A truce. Great. Then she's in your hands. Can you take her to sea? Not until the dock gate is open. The control room is definitely in Flim's hands now, so we're stuck. How many men do we have? Barely enough to hold them at bay. And even that, only until we run out of ammo. There's dozens of them.
Tom, I have a plan. You keep him distracted while I sneak out and open that gate. All alone? With the numbers they have, our only chance is not getting noticed. Oh, you're right. But we'll have to mount a diversion to make sure you do sneak out. Can we do that? Yes, boss. Let's do this before it gets even worse. Sam, we'll keep them busy. But still, be careful out there. Sam, wait for our signal. Roger that. Good luck, soldier. Thanks. Where do we go?
And now we can hold your people on for as long as we like. Stop this insanity now and surrender before you get all who once followed you killed. You're dropping that piece gun of the world to go. And it's my game that's up. You're delusional. Let's see if some smoke will help you clear your mind. Stop the frontal attack! Take cover and prepare to stop them all!
popular after all. Guess you put too much trust in your people's ability to stop me. Yeah, I see it. And it will cost them. But first, I will have you dealt with. Let the fuckers lose. When they're done with the chorus, bring me his skull. The new the noir spray. Astro. <sighs> so tacky. So that is why they capture these fools.
Clem, you are one tough bastard. Come here, you fucker! Shit! You're a beast, but you must be judged like a criminal. Where I come from, the mutineers hang. I'm in the tower. Situation under control. Sam, they're cutting through the hatch. Get that gate or we're done for. Order your people to stand down. Screw you, American! Surprise, motherfucker! Yeah. You fucker! I'll rip you apart! I left the curtain, but all I want is Break it down! Take him alive! Just, just go no, home. Never. Uh, st stay up. Uh, still up! I just can't. I promised Sam to get him home. And I'm willing to do everything. What could it be? Just nuclear? The one money clear and then we can fight. At least that's what it was. I'm sorry, Ed. But I couldn't do it.
I was an alien in Moscow. And even more so over here, where I had no friends. Tom offered me his hand. So what if that hand could push the button? Another nuclear war won't happen. The old world is already dead. A few more wounds on a corpse. What difference does that make? I don't think any price would be too high for a ticket home. Especially since I'm not the one footing the bill. My hope to see Dad is all I have left. All I've been dreaming of. All these years. I told you I would get Sam home. So? <sighs> Is this America? Look, what than I thought. It looks really worse than I thought. Okay, one, well, that's it for our main show franchise for now. I. I don't, I don't think I heard about it. Our uh, next Metro sequel? I, I don't think it did, did. But I really hope they will release soon because I really love this franchise. But um, I will go play again to see another ending. The ending that Sam detonated a uh, submarine. So let's see it. Stay up. <sighs> Still. Blow it up.
did what I'd been doing for the last 20 years. Saving the world. The captain sacrificed himself to avoid resurrecting the ghost of nuclear war. I would have gotten my ticket home. But at what cost? I'm not giving up. I will come home. For my opinion, I think the one that um, go back to America is the true ending. Because I don't think Sam would let get out to just give up in the end. And I feel like if I was Sam, I wouldn't I wouldn't give up the ticket to the home just because someone said and I think Sam is right. There's no, you know, I I don't think another nuclear war will uh, begin again because everything is already lost. But I think that's it. This is left for everyone to think about perspective and stuff. But that is it. My name is Alfasi, and for today, I'm out.